Hello today, and today we're going to have a game of something I'm not even going to bother to pronounce because it's in Japanese, but it's also known as Terra Diver. And this is on the Sega Saturn, and this is a game request by Jack Hacken on YouTube. Right, okay, as I said, this is in Japanese, it's a Japanese ROM. So I'm going to definitely struggle on what things translate in. But fortunately I've had a test run of this and I've got an inkling what they mean. Right, so we'll push our start button because that's in English of course. Um, right, so we'll push our start button again. Right, as far as I'm aware, that's one player. That could be two player. That is options and that is another game so you get a bonus game on this disc image so we're going to go into options right I don't know what the fuck that is that must be um, maybe difficulty I don't want to touch nothing I'm going to keep them all standard I don't know what the fuck that is I don't know don't know what the fuck that is. Don't know, don't know, don't know. Is that a level difficultiness? Um, I don't know. I'm not going to touch any of those settings just to make sure. Right. So, that's one player. I know that for a fact. Right, here we can choose what ship we want to pilot. I ain't got a fucking clue what their um, abilities are can't understand it so we get three ships to choose from with their pilots and you do to get a time limit on that because it selected it for me because I ran out of time right here we go let's just hope I've got the best all ground craft here we go yeah I don't know what all that's all that means I ain't got no clue I have no understanding of the Japanese language all I know I've got five credits <laughs> and it's three lives per credit okay here we go Graphically it looks really nice, seems to be playing very nicely at the moment, we'll see how, well, it looks like it's got a, definitely a an indicator of turning if you want the difficulty higher or lower, but I don't dare to touch it just in case I get the wrong settings, let's just keep it standard and see how it does. So if you push your second button, I say second button, there's multiple buttons on the same same controller. You get a smart bomb. Okay now. So it's don't have an auto fire mechanism. You have to keep tapping the button. Which is fine. I might rather have all the fire um, system, but you can't have everything. Maybe there's an option. I don't know. Anyone out there can translate translate Japanese into English? Please let me know. And I've already lost it. Right, excellent. So you can continue when you leave off. Exactly how continue should work. There's something I don't like is when you have to restart the game all over again. No point in having it's not continued then, is it? At least they got this one right. Got some nice music going on. I mean the graphics, you expect them to be brilliant, which they are. Really nice colours and textures here. Oh, for fuck's sake. Oh, 
power up, so I missed them all. Oh, I've got a couple. Whoa, look at this lot. I don't know what the other buttons do. Not a lot of fun piloting the ship. Ooh, that was close. Oh, come on! Oh, for fuck's sake! Oh, bloody, look at this lot, you bastard. Never continue. <laughs> oh, look at this lot. Oh, fucking hell. Oh, what's going on? There seems like a bit of a slowdown going on there. It's not like a 32 bit console to do that. Oh, come on. Bloody last credit. Look at this lot. Oh, no. Fucking escape. Oh. Oh. There we go, the level boss. This level's quite short on this. Oh, I missed the fucking... Whoa! Oh, come on! Fucking done it. What's this level two I've just completed? Yeah, that's my... Well, I don't even know. Is that my score? Oh. Yeah. Don't know what that is. Don't know what that is. It's probably giving me a message, um, mission briefing or something like that. Yeah, mate, whatever. Don't understand the lingo. More power-ups, power-ups, power-ups. Um, I'm liking it. I'm, I think this is a really good game. It's just shame it's not in English. Oh, look at these power-ups. Jeez. Oh, where am I going? Where am I going? Oh. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh. Ah, oh, for fuck's sake! Whoa, look at this! Oh, how am I going to escape that? Right, it's my last credit. You should get pick up your whatever you dropped. God, bloody hell! So every time you lose a life, you get your um, smart bombs back, which is good. Always a good thing. It's getting faster, it's getting faster. Oh, now we've got something good. Oh, it is. So we're getting closer to the ground. Also, we've done have control of that, but some really nice effects going on here. And if I can use another life. Oh, how am I fucking supposed to? It's my ah, fucking hell! Yeah, I bet that says game over. It did. Well, I knew what that was pretty obvious what that was going to say. That was obvious. Um, <laughs> yeah, I honestly thought that was a good game. I'm sure there is a way. I know there is a way. There should. One of those options was to turn down the difficulty level. But obviously, I didn't know what one it was. I, it could have been the one that says one, two, three, four, five, and so on. I reckon that could have been the difficulty level. But oh well. You know, it was still fun to play, um, even though it's in Japanese. Um, might be an English version out there somewhere, but I couldn't find it. I was lucky to find this version, to be honest with you. Um, or actually, Jack sent me the link to it. Um, but yeah, it's a good game. Well worth playing. If you like your shoot-em-up games, give it a go. 
Anyway, I'm going to end this now. Thank you so much for watching. Until next time, and goodbye.